Hello, welcome to today's episode of Trending. I'm your host as always. My name is Nancy Isime and of course Trending is brought to you by our darling sponsors Airtel. On this show we bring you everything and everyone that is trending but before we kick off the show proper please allow me to take a short break and when I come back I'll be revealing who my guest is for today. Stay with me guys, I'll be right back. Hi guys, it is still trending but to you by Airtel. On today's show, I have with me in the studio a Nigerian singer, songwriter and producer. Please let us welcome Adeshola Adesimbo Idowu, aka Red MC. <laughs> welcome. How are you doing, Nancy? How I'm very doing? well. How are you? I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. <laughs> you look really calm. Thank you. Are you okay? Okay, great, great. Are you excited about this? I'm a bit nervous. <laughs> That's what I'm say. She's a bit nervous if you didn't hear that, but it's fine. On this show is nothing mm -hmm. but love. I know mm -hmm. sometimes the questions can be a bit, you know, but trust me, today it's all <laughs> it's all love. Please be gentle. Just no problem. I will, I will. Let us talk about your style um, in our style update segment where you get to talk about what you're wearing and the inspiration behind it, please. Um, I just like to keep it simple, you know, okay. keep it me. It has to be comfortable, mm -hmm. you know. Um, I just basically throw stuff together. I don't really okay. think it through like that. I just mm -hmm. I want to be comfortable. Today I wanted to urbanize mm -hmm. a bit. So I've mm -hmm. got my um, cargo panties, my cargo pants mm -hmm. on, uh, my Versace trainers, okay. my trademark double watch. <laughs> really? um, my artifal hooked my blazer up, um, okay. my top, uh, the Aquari twins. Okay. Um, it, I just keep it simple, really. Okay, but why honestly. two watches, though? You say simple, but two watches is not really um, simple. It is simple, because the watches are not too, like, in your face okay. like that. Mm. Um, I'm, I'm like a time freak. Okay. You know, I'm a stickler for time. Okay. And it just came. I just said, oh, let me have two, two, two watches. Okay. So when one is trying yeah. to be funny, you're like, okay, then let me I can check it out. <laughs> I'm just like, and then I collect, I collect wristwatches. Wristwatches. Oh, so. okay, great, great. Okay, let us backslide a little. You know, you formed a hip hop band called The Weirdos with four of your friends. Yes. And um, but despite your popularity on campus, Weirdos kind of failed. You know, so um, you were not able to land a record deal during this time, and you guys had to disband. No, no, no. Okay. No, back up a little bit. We didn't fail. We, okay. we didn't even get to the point of actually trying to, you know, seek for a recording deal. Okay, okay. We split up way before. Oh, way you before split that. up way before that? Way before, what yeah. Happened? Um, I think I was kind of part of the problem. I was okay. very like, um, you know, bang on point rehearsals every day, 24-7. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. I, was, I, was, I think I was a bit too fussy. Okay. And then the others were like, oh gonna collapse i'm like this is hard work this mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah you see all the glam and tv the mm -hmm, lights mm -hmm, and all that but mm -hmm. behind the scenes we need to work hard yeah to get to that point mm -hmm. where we want to get to and mm -hmm. i remember the, the the main two figures that we were like, aspiring to we 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 were watching a lot of five star mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. cameo mm -hmm. and they just wanted to hang out have fun and i'm like yeah. hey come on this is i mean it was real campus so work. everybody wanted and to be young when it got to the point where i just felt like people were not really really dedicated mm -hmm. and devoted enough mm -hmm. You know, we just minded. I pulled out. Okay. Basically. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. Yeah. Um, now, you went off music um, for a while. You went off the music scene for mm. a while. And mm. um, from what we've been able to gather, you are planning to come back with an album. And um, D Tunes happen to be working on this <laughs> album. Please tell us about this. Uh, you guys are really digging. Um, <laughs> I had this sort of like a meeting in passing, so to speak, with D Tunes. Okay. I'm a huge, huge, you know, D Tunes, D -tunes fan. Okay. Um, I'm sure he would be, you know, um, cooking a couple of the songs. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't want to mention the names of the other producers because I'm really keeping a lot of stuff under wraps this okay. time around. Okay. Why is to that? To be honest with you, I just feel like, you know, just just be quiet, just work, do mm -hmm, your thing, mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. put out the works. Okay, okay. You know, basically, I feel like in the past I've said this and that, and I don't know. It's just it's not really like worked out so by something. Mm -hmm. in, okay, this time around shush and just work mm. Yeah. Mm. and so far so good i'm excited okay any collaborations well, yes actually okay. Okay. four already four already well, i'm not mentioning names. names it's fine we understand yeah. will it be coming out anytime soon the album i'm not saying anything anything okay you know what <laughs> is it coming out this year because this year no 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 so. i mean come on okay so maybe maybe okay. possibly a single okay. but an album no 
not this year. So you we're have to twenty sixteen. You have to try out the singles first, anyways. Okay. You know, for a while. At least, mm -hmm. at least, the way the market is right now, you mm -hmm. can't just you know mm -hmm. drop an album in the market. No, no, no. Okay. That's okay. A, no, no. You can't do that. Okay, but what strategy are you putting in place to actually come back into the Nigerian music scene? I'll never give my strategy away. Okay. That's definitely on the wraps. But okay. we're working, sincerely. Mm -hmm. We're really, mm -hmm. really, really working. But is the singles, the singles you're planning to put out there, is it part of the strategy you're trying to... Yeah, because I feel, things? you know, test the waters. And you, in my own case, I've been quiet for a while. You can't just come out, bam, the whole album. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For me, that's an honor. It might work for another brand. It might yeah. work for another artist. Mm -hmm. But looking at the market right now mm -hmm. people just want to taste the singles first so yeah. you want their appetite they now they have so you you, you sort of like build an expectation like okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. oh okay first single second single okay fair enough okay mm -hmm. ah, mama but although i heard people walk up to me on the street hey mm -hmm. mama what's up we're, we're waiting for the album, the album yeah. there was one girl one day i showed her she was like me i don't even care about singles, singles. just drop an album mm -hmm, you already mm -hmm, have a name mm -hmm. in it and all that and i'm thinking mm -hmm. no you don't you don't take things for granted yeah i believe that things have changed mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. you really really need to be careful mm -hmm, when mm -hmm. you're doing things now yeah, you yeah. can't just you can't just throw caution to the wind and mm -hmm. just like churning out albums no mm -hmm, for mm -hmm. me mm -hmm. it doesn't make sense okay but should we be expecting in some kind of twist to your style and absolutely. to your sound. No, okay. Absolutely, absolutely. Okay. The producers were, were even really, really fussy about that okay. this time around. Okay. Definitely, you know, we um, we're gonna be like playing around with a lot of genres. Okay. I've always been I've always been a sort of like a fusionist of some sort, anyways, okay. right from time. Mm -hmm. um, we'll be playing around with a, a whole lot of sounds, tones, mm -hmm. styles, you know, genres. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. and I'm excited. And nothing we're used to. I mean, no. Okay. No. Okay. You you might get a bit of what you're normally used to from mm -hmm. oh yeah what what else would do something like that but mm -hmm. you get something like what she did that she did that so great well we look forward to that now let's talk about the headies and um, I'm sure you know a lot about the headies uh, and you've of course been a part of it over the years I'm mean, a usual suspect <laughs> <laughs> but it's mm -hmm. around the corner and um, it is really trending right now in the entertainment industry in Nigeria and beyond so would you like to talk about one impact you think that the headies has had on African artists. You can't start to quantify. Mm -hmm. I remember when I picked up my headies mm -hmm. as far back as 2007. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was almost like I opened a box mm -hmm. filled up with magnificent gifts. Mm -hmm. It just sort of led me to all kinds of doors. Mm -hmm. It was like, oh, she has a headie. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh, that's my problem of the year. It, mm -hmm. you, you, honestly, you can't start to quantify. It does wonders, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. It, it, ha it has an, it has an immediate positive impact on your mm -hmm. on your profile and mm -hmm. your on your brand mm -hmm. on you as an artist. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. command more respect in the industry and outside the industry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, it's I can't explain. <laughs> Once you until you're holding you're one on stage one. and you're and you're talking and you're. You know okay. what it feels like, and you just feel special. You just know, like, oh, I worked hard for this, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and you know sometimes, sometimes in the house, I mess around with my idea, and you know because it's, it's it's the mouth is wide open, so yes, I squeeze yeah. the neck. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a picture I took one day. I put it on Instagram, like, okay. and I put a caption, mm -hmm. "Yay!" What I'm saying, I'm like, "Shush, shut up." Do you know how hard I had to work <laughs> <laughs> to even get to who do you the know first place? Do you understand? Yeah. So I look at it, and I'm like, hmm. I have a heady. If okay. honestly, it actually feels good. Mm -hmm, it's a mm -hmm. very, very, very special award. Special mm -hmm. award. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I have to say that okay. it is. Okay. Well, thank you for that. Now we're going to delve a little into your personal life. Mm. You granted an interview. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Well, it's, this this show is actually fun. No, oh, it's fun. It's not that serious. So trust me. Don't don't mind. Forget everything you've heard. This show is so fun. So so mm. fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's delve a little into your personal life. Um, you recently delivered, or you recently had an interview where, <laughs> where you talked about, <laughs> you know, getting married very no. soon. I never or, granted an interview. Okay, well, it marriage. was. It was. So, I don't think so. You don't think so? But it was sort of everywhere where people said, "Okay, you said you were going to get married soon, or something." So it might be wrong, but it was, was everywhere. Wrong. Exactly. So we need you to kind of clear. The I don't even that. remember granting that interview. Okay. And um, I don't know what it is. I, I think we're just obsessed. Okay. By marriage. Mm -hmm, mm hmm Are we actually obsessed by marriage, or are we obsessed by the wedding ceremony? I don't know what it is. Mm, sometimes. But, the but honestly, truthfully, I didn't. 
Granted. What happened was I remember I got a phone call from one of my friends in mm -hmm. England. She mm -hmm. was really, really upset. She was carrying on. How can you get married about telling us? And I'm like, huh? What are you talking about? Yeah. We heard you got married last week. I was like, you got married? <laughs> what? No, I didn't okay. get married. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. You know, because they know I'm, normally I'm very, I am very, very, very secretive. Okay. I'm very, very, very private. So private. She, she thought that it, it, must, it would, must have been a possibility. I'm mm -hmm. like, girl, no. Mm -hmm, it's just mm -hmm, not a story mm -hmm. out there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do you know how many stories I've seen? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, I'm supposed to be pregnant. Just, just me alone. I was pregnant last year. I got <laughs> married. married. I have a twin sister. <laughs> okay. I'm now a commissioner okay. in... Oshubu. In Oshubu. Oh, they said that too. Yeah, so. amazing. It's amazing. wonderful. I mean, I mean that, that was a that was a wonderful, wonderful room. Yeah, it was I a mean, positive news. So you were like, like ah, Mama, congratulations. You know, <laughs> you were probably walking this street like commissioner, yeah. the newest commissioner in town. So okay, but in all fairness, I'm sort of like used to it. Okay. It comes. It comes to the territory. You know, we do what we do. We're in mm -hmm. the public. We're in the public eye. So mm -hmm. there's always going to be stories. There's always going to be wild conjecture. Mm -hmm. So I guess I'm used to it. But do you see yourself getting married in <coughs> person? Yes and no. That's all I'd say. Why? Yes and no. Um, no, because I I feel a bit uncomfortable with the with the obsession. It's like we're obsessed by marriage on the side of the pond mm -hmm. in Africa. I don't know. Mm. Like. It's something that's meant to sort of like, I don't know. Change a woman's life, so or, to or speak. Or verify you, I don't know. Mm -hmm. What is it? Mm -hmm. Recently we were celebrating our sister. She got her property, Linda Ikeji. And then oh, the next, yeah. And then someone goes to her. Oh, but you're not married now, so, yeah, so what did you accomplish? And I'm thinking, are you for real? <laughs> <laughs> so, but I don't know. I don't know. Yes or no? What's the yes part? The yes part, mm, uh, it's, it's, it's not bad to settle down, but the no part, the thing is I'm a free spirit. Okay. Can I live that, can I, can I live that life? Mm -hmm, mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know if that life is for sure. I have a weird MC. I'm a free spirit. I'm... You don't see yourself I like to get. I like to just get up and go. Okay. You get me? Okay. And if you're going to settle down with somebody sincerely, you have to compromise. You have to make a lot of changes mm -hmm, and you, mm -hmm. you, know, you have to make a whole lot of compromises, most, mm -hmm. most definitely. Mm -hmm. Am I ready for that? Mm. Yeah, I like to sure. hop in my truck and zoom off, or Anytime. my jeep and zoom off. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't want to ask. I don't want anybody asking me, "Oh, where have you oh, been? Where you are you?" Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, no. But how do you feel? I, I love. I love my freedom. Okay, okay. That's honestly, that's the truth. I love my freedom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But how do you feel? Because a lot of people over the years, um, it might have bothered you a bit, but a lot of people over the years have. They've kept on, you know, um, trying to string you with the LBGT family. <laughs> how does it? How does it make you feel um, as a woman and an artist? It comes. It. I think it comes to the territory. Okay. And um, the average African. I'm African. I'm a proud African. Mm -hmm. The average African would normally condemn what they don't even understand. Mm -hmm, what mm -hmm. you know. Yes, I am a bit of a tomboy. Yes, I love my blazers. Mm -hmm. Yes, I love it's my shirts. Yes, I love my pants. But mm -hmm. do you not have to put me somewhere? Do you have to but stereotype you? Exactly. Do you have to put labels on me mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when I'm not even? Mm -hmm. But I think with time, I've sort of I just like brush it off and just ignore it. It upsets my family members sometimes, and yeah. I really, really feel bad. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm very close to family. I'm a family person, so mm -hmm. I talk to them about it. You know, mm -hmm. I'm really, really sorry you guys are go going through this, this, but I'm a public figure. This is what we go through sometimes. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. let them see. You mm -hmm. know, there's a song. Let them see. Elena Lulena. Let them keep talking. Wow. You are talking, so exactly. I will focus and keep rising and keep elevating and keep shining. Doing so music. you keep talking. Mm. Amazing, amazing. Well, thank you so much for clearing that. Thank you. Now, Red MC, would you like to share any sort of memory with us that you do not like to remember, but um, you know, it's just something that it's a part of you, but you'd like to talk about on this show? Uh, I think losing my mother, the way the way she left, mm. was really really painful, and I think because I was pretty much um, mommy's girl as well. Okay. I was really, really attached to her. I didn't expect her to check out, you know, what happened? at the time. Um, it was just one afternoon. I, I actually had an interview at OG, a okay. uh, uh, TV station I don't want to mention because we're yeah, And understand. I don't know, intuition. I just mm. said to my PA, let's go back home. 
I feel uncomfortable all of a sudden. And we went back home and I got to the house and I saw my grandma outside. She was crying mm. and I was like, what's wrong? And she goes, your mom, she's upstairs. I don't know what's wrong with her. And I, w I was shaking. I went upstairs, I, she had um, puked, you know. You yes. are lot to be. I said, don't worry, don't worry, you get better, when you get better. Oh, really? But it was never meant to be. So that for me, you know, that's a huge, huge. Do you remember how every time you, you know, remember the song Allen Avenue, oh, anytime he plays? Absolutely every time, especially when I'm performing on stage, because I remember just before we started shooting that Avenue, just before mm -hmm. she took ill, mm -hmm. she was always like, I want, I want to come and see you on stage, I'm I want saying. to see you. So she came to one to assure that I had a national stadium. Mm -hmm. And then she was like that. <laughs> You know, is that my daughter? Oh. I remember coming up and she was like, is everything okay? I said, everything is okay. <laughs> Why are you talking like that, right? <laughs> when I'm a stage, it's a different thing. That's yeah. where you just encountered Word MC, mm -hmm, but now mm -hmm. you're speaking to your daughter. Exactly. So at least I'm glad she got to like, see that experience, you know, yes. experience that. Thank but I really, so really wish. Mish, I know. She was still I around. Know. I know, I know. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for sharing that with us. Thank you. And I'm sorry about the pain. Thank you. So sorry. All right, guys, please enjoy the video of the day, but I'll be right back. Do not go anywhere, okay? Welcome back, guys. If you're just joining us, you're watching Trending brought to you by Airtel. If you have been watching, I hope you enjoyed the video of the day because we did right here. Now I have Word MC right here in the studio with me and it's been so much fun on the show, has it? Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. yes. Great, great, great. You're now, different. Oh, thank you. Yes. In case you didn't hear that, she said I'm different. She's different. Thank you very much. Intelligent, constructive questions. Oh, oh. Hey, thank you. My head is well in you. Thank you, Word MC. That means a lot. Right now, we move to the fast fire questions where you are given 60 seconds to answer as many questions as you can. 60 seconds. Yes, 60. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> yes. Time starts now. Favorite book? For the laws of power. Mm. Paris or New York? New York. Your first word? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Your best snack? Fry plantain. Native or English attire? Both. Your role model? Falakuzi. By road or by air? By air. Most embarrassing moment? Um, pass. Gold or diamond? Diamond. Your favorite movie? The Godfather. Music or movies? Music. Chocolate or cake? Chocolate. Favorite quote? Favorite quote, live and let live. Mm. Permanent or temporary tattoos? Temporary. Favorite place on earth? Okay. 
England. England. Well, thank you. You did very well <laughs> on your 60 seconds. That was really fast. Record time. Thank you for that. Now we'll move on to the next deal of the day, which is the tribe, where you get to give us full meanings of some social media abbreviations oh. and slangs. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. Easy peasy. Because I see some when I just <laughs> run down, I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> Don't worry. This one should not be that hard. <laughs> okay. What's that now? SMH. I don't even know. I, I say somehow. Okay. Well, it means shaking my head. Okay. LOL. <laughs> Laugh out loud. Oh, good. HBD. Happy birthday. Very good. Very good. IDK. I don't know, I guess. <laughs> Is that the answer? I don't know. That was yeah. good. That was good. Okay, I don't know. That was very good. Yeah, you got it right. Oh, I wasn't even sure. Oh, well, you did I now. just kind of guessed. Guessed. Okay. NVM? NVM. 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 Hmm. I've seen it a couple of times. Mm -hmm. I don't know. New variety, but... <laughs> <laughs> or never whatever. Never marry. <laughs> never marry. <laughs> Would you like me to help you? Please. Okay. It means never mind. Yes. Mm. Okay, last one now. LMK. LMK. I have no idea. It means let me know. Oh, well, you think so. <laughs> <laughs> a new generation. It's okay. It's fine. <laughs> well, thank you so much. You did well. You were able to answer a couple. Thanks. Thank thanks. you so much. All right, guys. Those are most of the social media abbreviations we have for you on the show today. Please allow us to take a short break. And when we come back, it'll be time for some nasty comments to roll in. Welcome back to Trending, brought to you by Airtel. It is still Nancy, it's Simia here, and this is the Nasty Comment segment where we get to see the nasty things that some people have to say about our guest, Red MC, on social media. It is time for the Nasty Comments to roll in! Did I scare you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm even spying. You're trying to see, oh no. Um, well, Okay, so I'm going to give you this iPad. You are going to read the comments and react to them individually. Just three. Three. Yes. Bleached. Oh my God, what is she has bleached? And she's so old. Hmm. Oh, wow. And maybe you are the one buying me the bleaching cream. Old. I. I don't know what to say about that. Let us see if you are not going to age. It acts the effort spent in crafting this pointless rebuttal could have been spent in producing a decent heat worth performing, but she spends more time generating buzz on social media. I don't think there's anything wrong in me generating buzz on social media. It's part of what I do. Innocent said, when I'm still get married the day we have uninterrupted electricity, supply all over Nigeria permanently. Innocent, you are so right, I love <laughs> thank you for this thank you thank you <laughs> tell me how do you feel about these comments it's normal let me tell you something mm -hmm. if you're out there in any form see it's a natural thing if if you have like what's that game mm -hmm. you know that thingy that round stuff i've forgotten what it's called now where you can just throw stuff mm -hmm. you, you know the dartboard. Oh, no. If you just see a dartboard on the wall, mm -hmm. you trust me. The chances are you won't just walk past the dartboard. You want to mm -hmm. fling some darts. It's just normal. It's just natural. Mm -hmm. And some people, in all honesty, they really, really, really want what you have, and they can't have it. Mm -hmm. So the only thing they can do is be nasty. Mm -hmm. They're frustrated. Mm -hmm. So I'm sorry. I can't. You can't help Medicine. Me. But I can give you some Panadol, though. <laughs> some painkillers. Right, MC, thank you so much for coming on the show. Thank, thank you so much for your reactions to the nasty yes. comments. And thank you so much for answering all my questions. I appreciate this. I hope you had a good time on the show. Absolutely. Amazing, amazing. I hope you come soon, soon. Yes? Yes, fingers crossed. Very soon. Okay, well, thank you so much. Thank you. All right, guys, I'll leave you with the top five. Enjoy.
Okay, guys, that is unfortunately all we can take on the show today. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a great show. I hope you enjoyed the show. Make sure to follow the conversation. Follow us on Twitter at Hip TV and on Instagram at official hip tv you can also follow me if you wish at nancy isime official on instagram you can also watch us online at www.hiptv.tv till i see you next time do not forget to leave laugh and love i love you but god loves you more take care and bye